Okay. So, we need the keys. It's not damaged. Man, this place didn't get looted. Nothing useful about the ATM steel. Do you have anything new? Probably not. How's he doing? I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Nothing new. Okay. I want the cane. It would help me do what I need to do. I'm trying to think like an adventure game game. Why aren't you helping me out with this? That's what I figured. Hmm. I cannot into brain. It really doesn't seem to be anything else I can do in here, because this but is just this again. To survive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like one of the most hurt up on the dead. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Wish there was a way Protect to skip stuff you've already seen. Talking to Carly, so we can go to the hotel somehow, I guess? Still don't know how we're gonna get the hell out of here to do that, but whatever. I don't know why my frames are getting so bad. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. How? Oh, we're gonna go out through the alley, I guess. That would make sense. That was easy. Uh, perhaps it's freaking out again. I might need to restart the game. That was... You guys didn't see that? Okay, one second. I'm gonna try and restart the game. Okay, here we Get go. Down. Now, with less fraps hating the game, turn the shadows down a bit and restart it. So, definitely seems to be working better. Sometimes a computer just needs a little break, especially when it's like 110. Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. No Listen, shit. I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Sure we can. can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about it if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Now th this is a stupid idea. <laughs> Down. 
we can hide by that pickup. The girl's behind that door. Those two seem to be on the scent. Where to next? This has so much potential to go horribly wrong. To the RV, or down to the truck if we're quick and quiet about it. There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. I'll cover you if you sneak over to the RV. Well, I want the gun so I can use it There's as one a. Uh... There, trying to get into a room, but I didn't see anyone actually in there. Okay. Well, now we're here. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I have a weapon. I have a pillow. Well, I got one pillow and two corpses. An age-old problem. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. I'm gonna go back over by the truck. Unless... Nope, can't use the pillow on him. Let's see if there are any goodies down here. That will help us murder dead things. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Aha! What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Put the, the pillow on the do window that? and you punch it. I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. Too easy. We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. That was sick. So far, so good. Okay, what's down? Oh, that's back that way again. Here's that guy. Okay. Hell, am I gonna do with that? It's a sparky thing. Spark plug. You should hold on to that. I come in handy. Okay then. There's a lick in the truck. Wait. 
Let me see the spark plug. Do you have a cunning plan? Listen, inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Cool. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Okay, progress. Uh, let's see. Can I go back to the other place? Can I go back to the RV? Now oh, there we go. Let's head back to that wall. Same there. Okay. How you doing, Stinky? Candy Graham. <laughs> Boy, these guys rotted fast. As big as the Prime Walker Killer. I should be able to take those guys out when they come around the corner of the RV. the face. How about enough of your shit, zombie? Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. <laughs> now we've got this. Are you two done? <laughs> Uh, macho, macho man. No more. That should help. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. I like this chapter. We're being productive. Some too, <laughs> bitch boy. Jesus, rat is what I do. How is this boarded up from the outside? Hello, in there, we're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute, if you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. She's in trouble. Miss, we're coming in. This is a bad idea. <sighs> God. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh, God. I... I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, Aww. she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have oh, a boyfriend? that sucks. Glenn. God I damn it, Glenn. That. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me, please go. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? 
give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No! Then shoot her. Huh? I've seen what hell is like and it's coming back as one of those things! Shoot her! Help her out here. You're insane! Just take this thing! Yeah, we do have an axe. We could just... Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. We can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? We, we need the gun. Why not? Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. <sighs> the fun decisions. God bless you, all right? God bless you too. See, it would have been better if he'd done it for her. There's actually a story about that in World War Z about a uh, a Russian missionary priest who, because uh, the general thing for the Russian soldiers were to shoot themselves if they got bitten, and he was tired of that shit, so he, he decided to do it himself so that no more young souls would be sent to hell. Everyone all right? Suicides bad. Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine. And, well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out of here. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. That was ducky. What are we do? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. <laughs> you guess. Guess nothing's really changed here. Um. Hmm. Anything new? Probably not. I'm gonna get back to him. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's good. Oh well. Uh, where's Glenn at? And what's her face? Oh, hey, kiddo. How you doing? How's your finger, Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. That's good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. <laughs> you know. I was gonna say. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. I got points for checking on Clementine. How you doing, Clem? You know. Back to the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess. But that's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Well, you haven't Good. been bitten yet either, have you? Good. You let her do it, you know. You said give her the gun. I know I did. Why the hell would you do that? Mercy, man. I couldn't let her go on like that. We couldn't. You never know. You can't give up hope. I think it was over for Glenn. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? Oh, you know. I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. Shit. Hmm, that's not good. What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Try to get some rest. This <laughs> is nice. I don't... Yeah, right. I don't really hate any of the characters, and I kind of expected to. So I'm pleasantly surprised. Story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first-hand accounts. You do radio. That's right. Well, until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding, and I hit the blogosphere. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. 
Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have oh, a look around? We have outside? the fire axe now. Okay, so that's probably good. Yeah, let's, let's have, have a look, a look around. around. Okay. 